Thank you guys for coming. <laughs> all right, all right. Now, I, hold on. I appreciate it. It is. Uh, I'll end with this. This 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 is a, this is a newer story. It, it is. It's always fun. I, mean, I appreciate you guys coming out. It can be tough in Nashville to get people to come to a comedy show because I feel like every night we, there, I have a comedy show. There's always like a bigger music show going on in town. That always hurts, you know. So I've, for years, I have always wanted to promote a fake music show <laughs> and get people to come to that and then at the last minute switch all the information over to my comedy show <laughs> just hoping they show up I've always wanted to do that a couple years ago I had a show with my buddy Joe Kelly he and he had a big show coming up I said let's do it so we went home we made a Facebook group for Kid Rock live at Captain D's that's the show we made <laughs> And I gotta tell you, it was gonna be a great show. For $20, you could see Kid Rock perform a live acoustic set at the Jefferson Street Captain D's here in Nashville. And if you really want to ball with the ball out for $40, you can get a laminated pass, a meet and greet, and a 12-piece butterfly shrimp. So it was gonna be, it was gonna be an amazing show. If you're thinking there's no way anybody thought this was a real event, you don't know a lot of diehard Kid Rock fans because Two days in, we have 2,000 people RSVP to come see Kid Rock at Captain D's. People are messaging me about buying tickets. They're booking flights and hotels to come see this show. And I said, listen, I'm not a lawyer, but I think the second I accept money for this Kid Rock show, that I'm pretty sure is not going to happen, um, that is fraud, maybe, or money laundering. One of the two. I don't know. It's bad, though, right? So here's what we did. We said, listen, we can't sell you the tickets online. You gotta go to Captain D's in person. <laughs> I feel bad about this, but it happened, okay? You gotta go to Captain D's and buy the tickets in person. 30 people that we know of showed up at Captain D's. Now, I like to think they went through the drive-through. Don't y'all, doesn't that make it a lot more fun? One guy commented in all caps, just went to Captain D's. They were very angry and confused. So I deleted that right away, right? I can't, the gig's not up yet, right? We gotta hide that. A couple days go by, 5,000 people have RSVP to come see. I don't know how big they think this Captain D's is, but they're excited. A buzz is a building, right? Finally, I said, listen, it's, it's, it's too late. I don't want people to spend money. I already feel bad about this. Here's what we did. We wiped all the information from the Facebook event. We took Kid Rock's picture down, put our picture up, <laughs> and we look a little different. So um, it was quite a shock. Took all the air information out. We said, listen, Kid Rock is no longer doing a show at Captain D's, but if you're hungry for some real entertainment, <laughs> come see this comedy show. A harmless joke. I want to read you a few of the comments that Kid Rock fans left because some of these guys did not take it in stride. I'll say that much. Darlene says, hey, fatso. You know, that's, that's a great way to get my attention. I'll be honest. I was like, I'm on board. What do you got to say? She says, you will never be Kid Rock and you wish you were. That checks out. He's doing well. You know, I'd, I'd like a career, you know. Hope you like lawsuits, toodaloo. You know, who likes lawsuits, Darlene? Come on. This one really got me. John says, I hope you get AIDS. And then, <laughs> and then he commented right below that, just to be clear, full-blown AIDS. <laughs> I was like, I do appreciate you clearing that up. I wasn't sure what you meant. And then this one really got me. It was an older woman, and she looked very friendly. Her name was Myrtle, and she commented, Honestly, young man, this was not a nice thing to do. <laughs> but you know what? None of those people came to see our comedy show, but you guys came out tonight. Thank you so much for being here. My name is Aaron Weber. You guys have a great night. Thank you all very much. Give it up for Aaron Weber.